In South Florida, Broward County, an infamous street gang known as the Alwoods Gang operated since the 1990s. This was shaken up by the Broward Sheriff's Office working with many of its units and other federal law enforcements. <laughs> Since 2017, Broward Sheriff's investigators started their investigation. A rise in crime was running rampant as Broward Sheriff's Office detectives noticed an uproar in drug overdoses, fentanyl sales, and a rise in gun violence. In the Broward County, South Florida region, after a variety of investigations, detectives targeted the Elwoods gang, powerful and organized, running the streets of Broward County since the 1990s. Hi, I'm Sergeant Stephen Hondras with the Broward County Sheriff's Office Gang Investigations Unit. So today we concluded a multi-year investigation into the Elwoods gang. This uh, particular gang uh, had been involved in the distribution of large quantities of very dangerous narcotics. Uh, and pushing out large quantities of fentanyl and heroin out onto the street. And additionally, they were involved in um, violent crimes, shootings. They sold drugs and enforced their crimes all over the northern hemisphere of Broward County and southern Palm Beach County. Search warrants were obtained and about two dozen gang members were arrested. So recently we secured arrest warrants for 24 members of the gang uh, for charges relating to racketeering violations and conspiracy to commit racketeering. Um, some of which, uh, some of which the subjects were already in police custody. Um, and so today we went out and we began systematically and methodically picking up everyone. After investigations, the members of the gang were held accountable for drive-by shootings, robberies, burglaries, and weapons mayhem chaos. Also, these gangs were involved with turf wars and homicide of rival gang members. This all happened in the Broward County, Palm Beach, and Miami-Dade counties. Throughout the shakedown of this gang, detectives seized more than 40 kilograms of cocaine, more than 20 kilograms of heroin, and over a thousand pills of narcotics. They also seized more than 70 firearms and a whopping more than $800,000 in cash, as well as property and valuable assets. Not to mention houses, marine boats, automobiles, and over $1 million in gold and jewelry. In conclusion, the takedown of this gang was made possible with the joint efforts of Broward Sheriff's Office operations with their crime unit, money laundering unit, their gang investigations unit, their suppression unit. Also, they also had help with federal law enforcement such as DEA, AFT, Homeland Security Investigations, U.S. Marshal Services, and the Boca Raton Police Department, all in conjunction. And uh, you know, our community was crying out to us, so we began a, uh, an investigation into this uh, identified street-level gang that was terrorizing the neighborhood. So during the course of this investigation, we seized um, large quantities of narcotics to include cocaine, heroin, fentanyl. Uh, we're talking about upwards of 20 to 40 kilos of each. Um, we've also seized over a million dollars in jewelry, uh, large amounts of currency, uh, around 800,000. We've also seized um, over 70 firearms during the course of this investigation from this, from this group. With years long of investigations, at the end, approximately 70 gang members and allies of the gang were taken down and arrested with 100 plus personnel arrested on various criminal charges connected by this gang group. As the Broward Sheriff's Office says in a statement, Violent drug gangs are a scourge in the community. Their illegal activities bring nothing but pain and suffering to neighborhoods and hard-working law-abiding citizens. As of now, the Broward Sheriff's Office is still investigating the Alwoods gang in order to prevent any future growth and influence they might have on the future young generations to come. As always, my name is John Gustavo, an aspiring reporter bringing you the news out of Broward County, South Florida. With that being said, I'll see you on the next. Take care and have a good one. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next.